For most of the time, the price remains in the range bound zone, so we can get comparatively low time for the successful entry and exit. For achieving high success in the trading, it is highly required to identify the current trend and to get the prediction for the next move of the price. This all may be possible if we have a good knowledge of the technical indicators. Today we will discuss about one of such indicators, which is called the Williams Alligator Indicator. But before going ahead in this interesting video, if you are new to our channel, then hit the like button and subscribe our channel, so you cannot miss our upcoming videos. Now let us understand our today's topic. The Alligator Indicator is one of the most popular indicators among the traders, it helps us to identify the trend as well as the direction of the trend. There are basically three lines in the alligator indicator. The green line represents the lips of the alligator, while the red line represents the teeth, and the blue line represents the jaw of the alligator. According to the default setting, the green line is the five-period smooth moving average moved by the three bars into the future. The red line is the eight-period smooth moving average moved by the five bars into the future. And the blue line is the 13 period smooth moving average moved by the 8 bars into the future. Now let us understand that how does the alligator indicator work. When all the three lines are twisted together, its meaning is that the mouth of the alligator is closed and he is sleeping right now. During this situation the price remains in the range bound zone, and we should not make any trade during this period. Now here you can see, the green line cross over the other two lines from downside to upside, and after that all the three lines start to move in the upward direction and move apart from each other. It means the alligator is waking up. This situation indicates the start of the uptrend. The distances between the lines specifies that how much strong the trend is. If the distances between the lines get increased, the trend becomes stronger. After a strong uptrend, here these three lines changes its direction toward the downward side, which indicates that the current trend is going to be end, and reversal may occur soon. Now when the green line crosses the other two lines from upside to downside, it indicates the start of the downtrend, and as the three lines becomes wider, the downtrend gets stronger. Till here, I have explained the concept of the alligator indicator with high clarity. Now it's turn for our strategy. In our strategy, for more accuracy, we will use the combination of the RSI and the Alligator Indicator. Let us understand about the RSI Indicator in short. RSI is a momentum oscillator, which keeps fluctuating between the 0 and 100 level. When RSI moves below 30 level, it is said that the stock is oversold. From here, the reversal may occur, and price may go in the upward direction. Similarly, when the RSA moves above 70 level, it is said that the stock is overbought. From here, the reversal may occur, and the price may go into the downward direction. But in our strategy, we will not use the concept of the oversold and overbought levels. Instead of that, we will use the 50 level to identify the trend of the price. When RSI will be above the 50 level, it will be called the bullish trend. Similarly, when the RSI will be below the 50 level, it will be called the bearish trend. Let us take an example for the buy setup. Here we have the graph of a stock on 15 minute time frame. As you can see here, after a range bound zone, the green line successfully crosses the red line and blue line towards the upward direction. Here, the red line also crosses the blue line towards the upside, and after that all the three line gets apart from each other which is the sign of a good uptrend. Now wait for a pullback for the accurate entry. After moving in the uptrend, here the price takes support between the area of the green line and red line. Thus, this is our required pullback. Now we will make our entry at the candle, which closes above the green line. Here, at this point, this candle closes above the green line, and the same time the RSI is above the 50 level. So, this candle becomes our trigger candle. We will buy at the high of our trigger candle, we will keep our stop loss at the blue line, because the jaw of the alligator is very strong to break, 
so it will be very hard for the price to break the blue line. For the target, we will exit when the price crosses the red line. You can see the result, after our buy entry, the price made a wonderful up move. Now let us take an example for the sell setup. Here, we have the chart of a stock on 15 minute time frame. As you can see here, after the range bound zone, the green line crosses the blue line towards the downside. Here, the red line also crosses the blue line towards the downside, and after that all the three lines get apart indicating a good downtrend. Now, as discussed before, we will wait for the pullback. After moving in the downward direction, here the price takes resistance at the area between the green line and red line. Thus, this is our required pullback. Moreover, this candle closes below the green line, and at the same time, the RSI is below the 50 level. So, this candle becomes our trigger candle. We will sell at the low of our trigger candle, our stop loss should be at the blue line, and for our target, we will exit when the price crosses the red line. After our sell entry the price moved in a wonderful downtrend. This strategy does not work all the time, but when it works, then it shows very good results. That was all. My dear viewers, we do so much hard work to make these types of valuable videos. So, if you liked our video, then show your support by hitting the like button, and make sure to subscribe our channel, so you cannot miss our upcoming videos. Take care of yourself.